you know, it's not like that today's a surprise. Uh, you know, I think, you know, six weeks ago, you, you all were writing about it and saw it coming. So uh, we've had our, our chance to get comfortable with it. Turner won 59 games as head coach of the Chargers for the past seven years. He won three playoff games with the team and won the AFC West in each of his first three years as coach. However, the team fell short of getting to the league's championship game, the Super Bowl. The Chargers have also failed to make the playoffs for three straight years. Turner says he knows that winning is the key to holding an NFL head coaching job, and he says he knows he nearly lost his job a year ago. Dean has has really been, as I said, been great. Uh, you know, I think uh, he made a decision last year at the end of the year uh, based on what he thought was best for the guys in this room. Uh, you know, it didn't work out, and uh, I, I understand it's a business. Chargers president Dean Spanos called both Turner and A.J. Smith consummate professionals, and he praised them for their determination and integrity. But at the end of the day, Spanos says it is about winning. Well, obviously, if you don't win, fans aren't going to come. And, uh, and this is, I think this is part of our business. And, uh, you know, but, I, you know, as I said earlier, I mean, our goal is to put a winning, uh, you know, product on the field, and we haven't done that in the last three years. So uh, it's, not, it's not a good thing when you don't see the fans in the stands. Spano's call today tough because he's worked closely with both men for a long time. But he says the decision was made when the Chargers lost to Carolina and the team's playoff chances were snuffed out. Uh, I knew at the beginning of the season that if we didn't get into the playoffs and win some games that I was probably going to have to make this decision. Um, but uh, I'm looking forward now to the process of hiring a new general manager and a new head coach.